Welcome back to Coin Sense and Nonsense. Today, we're hunting quarters. Getting shut out at the bank with half dollars. Actually, the half dollar game in Southern California is pretty much over. It's hard to get them, and when you do get them, they're searched for silver. So quarters might still be a, an opportunity. And I even went to nickels, so we'll do nickels another time. Today it's quarters, so let's check for silver for some of the newer quarters. I'm, uh, I kind of set quarters aside for a while, haven't really been hunting, so what seems new to me might be old to you, but uh, let's check them. All right, so yeah, even getting quarters has been a challenge here, so they wouldn't give me a full box this time, only $200 worth, so let me check them out and or let's check them out and some of the newer designs as i was mentioning uh may not be new to everyone else but this is the latest one that i do have i am going to try to put together the women and quarters book i don't have it started yet but uh, maybe we'll do that here at the end we'll see what we get all right first roll nothing exciting some kind of limited mintage coins but this one looks like it's got some green garbage there, so I'm going to toss that back. And Puerto Rico, uh, not the most limited uh, mintage, but still kind of cool from 09. So I have a tube with these. I'll set that aside. And then I did get the requisite so-called newer designs. So these are all the Denver mint, but... Um, where I am, the Philadelphia coins are the ones that are hard to come by. So we'll keep going. Not going to show you every roll, but uh, bring you in if there's anything exciting. All right, let's go on through the coins and came across the new one. Kind of threw me for a, for a loop at first. I thought it was like a foreign coin, but that's the new one. So cool, I like that design. Don't really care for that one so much. <laughs> that one so much, but uh, cool. So now I think I've got all, at least all the Denver ones represented of the women uh, quarters. So we'll definitely start that album. Let's keep going. All right, so going through the one of the rolls here, how many are we down already? Eh, halfway. Or this will be halfway after this one. And there is a foreign coin. For, hello! There, may she rest in peace. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Someone took a file to it. Oh, got to turn it that way. So Canadian 06. Is that 06 or 05? 06. So, yeah, scrape job, road rash, whatever. Alright, we're done with that first pack of 10. The only thing exciting, or not really exciting, was that jacked up uh, Canadian quarter. We got one Arizona Philadelphia to check for the extra cactus, and it doesn't have it. You'd look at the designer initials if it was obscured, so that one's going back. And then some of the lower mintage coins, um, so from 2012, um, there were a lot of low mintage coins. Hawaii Volcanoes was like the transitional one. The Philadelphia had relatively few, but the Denver was back in full swing. Anything under 100 million minted, I'd consider, you know, semi worth setting aside. Uh, but Denali, they were back in full swing. So that's definitely a no saver. Um, and then 2011, these were more in like the 30 million minted zone. But this one's messed up, so I'm not going to save it. So let's get on with the second batch. All right, we're down to the last three. Got to clear some of the carnage here. Uh, set aside several bicentennials. I checked for doubling, nothing special condition-wise, so they're going back. And then Philadelphia is known for the majority of the varieties or mint errors or whatever. 
South Carolina, there's a doubled branch that's worth checking for. This one didn't have it. And likewise, uh, the Wyoming, Philadelphia, you got to check around the horn there, the saddle horn, if there's extra metal there. Doesn't have it. Earlier, I showed the Arizona cactus, extra cactus, whatever. That one didn't have it. This one does. Check it out there. Look at the designer initials. And you can see, maybe you can't see, the right, the left hand initial is, is covered up. So here you can see the initials are obscured on the left there. The, I think the JF of the JFM is blocked by a so-called extra cactus. Right, going through coins, figure to bring you in. This was an ender. This is our second one. I'll try not to put a big fingerprint on that. <laughs> On that one, like I did the first one, and then what the heck else did I see here? Oh, do, 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 do. this is Chaco Culture. This one is kind of lower on the minted scale, so Denver. So that's cool. All right, down to the last one. Might as well check it. Hmm. Let me go through them. I'll be back. All right. Unfortunately, that's going to do it. We got uh, 2010 lower mintage. This one's kind of in the 30 millions. I'll put the exact mintage up on the screen there. Same with the Gettysburg. I want to say 33 something, but the, the Chiron will tell you exactly. And then Chaco Culture, this one's cool. That's probably my favorite lower mintage find. I want to say these are more in the 22 million zone, but the graphic will tell you. I did get like all the different newer designs, the women in quarters or the American women quarters, whatever. Even the latest one. Very funky how it has 25 cents and not quarter dollar i think that's the first one to have that so i've got enough to start the book let's uh, throw some in the book i did find some philadelphias and another coin roll hunt so we will incorporate those. All right, we got them all in the book here. So got both Washington crossing the Delawares, both Maya Angelou's. Missing one of the Sally Rides, the Philadelphia. I think I've got it, but just don't have it here. Will Mankiller and Nina Otero Warren got them both. That one so far is the lowest minted of the American women quarters, at least the published mintage. Anna Mae Wong, got them both. Bessie Coleman, missing the Philadelphia. And then same with uh, Edith Kanaka Ole. I do like that one. So Eleanor Roosevelt still to come. And I thank you so much for watching Coin Sense and Nonsense. And until next time, bye bye.